These goggles helped a blind man see for the first time in decades. Là, un truc que je, que je vois. The man first realized he could see when he was out on a walk. What the patient was able to do was to see the crosswalks in the street. And I was so ecstatic. This 58-year-old started losing his sight as a teenager from a genetic condition called retinitis pigmentosa, or RP. It affects 2 million people worldwide, and for most, there is no treatment. In retinitis pigmentosa, patients are initially losing peripheral vision. Eventually, central vision becomes blurry, and then they become blind. Typically, those who suffer from RP lose their vision permanently. But a first-of-its-kind treatment from biotech company Gensite Biologics suggests that some sight can be restored. What I heard from the patient is that uh, this is giving them the impression that the eye is alive again. The technique uses gene therapy to alter the cells in the eyes and specialized goggles to activate them. The method has its origins in nature. A couple decades ago, scientists discovered a special protein derived from algae that reacts to light. Scientists use viruses to deliver these proteins into the brains of animals, genetically modifying nerve cells so they become light sensitive, a technique called optogenetics. Using light, they can activate nerve cells to learn how the brain works. But researchers at Gensite wanted to try the technique on a human retina. It seemed totally crazy because how would you bring something from an algae into the eye and uh, try to restore some vision? In an eye of one patient, scientists modified retinal cells making them sensitive to amber light. Then they designed goggles embedded with a special camera that transforms images from the real world into pulses of amber light, beamed directly into the eye. But researchers weren't sure if patients could interpret this new visual language into sight. After seven months, they had a breakthrough. So the patient was able to grab the object, to point to them, and to count. This is a simulation of what the patient probably would see. It's not perfect vision, but it is uh, giving you the ability to see the edges, the shapes of what you see. Because of the pandemic, Gensites conducted its study just on one patient. But experts still believe the limited results are significant. This is a very, very convincing result, even though it's only one patient. And now the effort will be focused on which method of this kind is the best, how can you refine it, Will you be able to recognize the face of somebody? Will you be able to read? How does it feel? Too tight, too loose, you're good? Nine patients are currently testing Gensite's treatment, and the company is working to expand the clinical trial. It's a golden era for many conditions that nobody thought we could treat, so sometimes we should be a bit more optimistic in life than what we are. <laughs>